Alright, hello, welcome to some Singe gameplay. I just had the craziest game in the last like month, okay? This was this is an absolutely crazy game on Singed, playing Singe mid, right? Uh, but first, I gotta remind y'all, 97% of y'all are not subbed, so please, it's free, it helps me out more than you know, and uh, yeah, that's, that's all I wanted to say. But, back into the game, we're against a Victor. It's pretty similar to um, Oriana mid, the Oriana mid matchup. Sorry, this might be a little loud. The Oriana mid matchup, it's very, very annoying that he's ranged and also has phase rush. So, what you do is just kind of farm, but don't try to like do anything too crazy because most of the time you probably won't be able to do anything because they have self shield they can slow they have phase rush they can just run away it's very very rough so you probably want to tell your jungler that hey it's going to be a rough for rough mid for a bit and we're just going to chill okay we're, we're just going to be like mm, well I, i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna like stay safe and not do anything wild that might screw my lane all right you want you want to be able to get to level six without dying at all all right because that that it's it's rough okay i know it's very very boring especially in these these games you're going against a range matchup right and you just sit there it's really really boring i hate it i think it's really really cringe right but that's just kind of what you have to deal with if you play Singed, right? So here I take a lot of damage, unfortunately. And uh, for whatever reason, uh, this game starts off really, really weird. I don't know what it, what it was about, but like... I, I don't know. The, the, like, everyone's just roaming. There's like randomly people fighting in the river, like... Blitzcrank shows up top lane, Alistar shows up mid jungle, like, I don't know, this game was like a mess, right? Speaking of mess, uh, this Riven was, uh, <laughs> not exactly the most pleasant person to play with, I'll say. Uh, they're, they're not, they're not like, a very supportive or very positive people, so it definitely made the game harder than it should've. Uh, because of how they were acting and how they were uh, approaching the game, right? Uh, spoilers, uh, we do win. And spoilers, we do have the most damage on the team. So first things first, we start a corrupting pot. We go Doran's ring. If we can kill, right? If we can, oh, if we can uh, kill the mid lane multiple times, then obviously you get a get a ring, right? A little dark seal. But generally, it's Corrupting Pot into Doran's Ring for the sustain, if, if that's needed, or if you can just straight up buy components for Protobelt. Um, and that's what I'm rushing. Uh, I had a game before this where I was against a set, and I saw the enemy team also had a bunch of other, like, burst. It was just a bunch of bursts, right? And for those kinds of games, you're not going to be able to just kind of Protobelt in and try to do anything. Right? They're, they're just going to turn on you and you die. Right? So the first thing I did was rush Zhonya's. It's not too bad. It's actually pretty cheap. I think twenty six fifty now. Before it used to be a lot more, a lot, a lot rougher to get. Right? And that saved me like crazy. It, it saved me so much hassle when I can just go, ah, I don't, I don't want to fight anymore. I'm going to Zhonya. Right? If I'm getting dived by set, I just... Presanius, right? If I if I if if a team fight happens and everyone's trying to focus me, I just press Zanias, right? Um, a few items that you should take note of is Abyssal Mask, because it's getting buffed, right? Abyssal Mask, right? Gives you MR, but the main thing is that immobilized targets are um, take 15% increased damage. But the main thing is you get tanky. You get tanky and you just have 15% more damage when you flip someone or W, I believe. Is I think ground counts as immobilize. Which is uh, the, the main thing that I want to touch on. 
Uh, but yeah, we are building our proto belt. Our Rengar is single-handedly carrying our early game. Uh, it's kind of looking rough, but it is only seven minutes into the game. It's seven minutes into the game, and there's 14 kills. This is this is just typical plat three shenanigans, you know? It's it's really yeah. Here we see uh, the the fun interaction of Victor pressing W Q and autoing me for phasers proc plus ugh god yeah he gets a little too close um and Rengar Rengar Blitzcrank are just roaming the map together and killing everyone which is like I I don't have an issue with that it's it's a little strange but I don't have an issue with that. Now Rengar gets caught over here. Uh, not much I can do. Uh, a little bit strange that he would just kind of run in like that without very much vision. Like he had a pink and that was kind of it. Um, but yeah. Uh, at this point we're only, we've only died twice in lane, right? We're farming well, we're up one wave. Uh, probably gonna even out now. But yeah, here we pick up our first part of our proto belt, which is the Hextech Alternator. Sorry, my voice is going all creaky. Ooh. <clears throat> I need to drink some water. Pardon me. <clears throat> oh, that was weird. Sorry. Um, my my sleep schedule is absolutely messed up. It's awful. What a what a terrible time. <laughs> yeah. Um, so we're, we're building port built first, uh, so we can just directly engage onto the victor. Um, when he W's us, right, we can just dash out and then flip him because we get increased movement speed. We get a dash, right? If he tries to kite us, we're, we're just going to flip him. And, uh, at, after a certain point, I, he won't do enough damage to kill you, at least for a bit. Yeah, this is uh, this is very very it's just patient play because like you you're just like here you know you're just here. Sorry, my my throat is dying. Yeah, so I run top. I'm gonna we're just gonna flash ignite, right, and just run this Garen down. Garen's being annoying. I'm just gonna yoink right, and here we go. I know I can fight this because I have my ult running and I'm up two levels. I also have my, uh, my what's it called? Corrupting Potion running. And as long as I throw W on Alistar so you can't CC me, I beat the Olaf. Alright, and here, uh, Alistar has Phase Rush, right? So he just kind of speeds off, which is, which is okay. Uh, we pick up two kills by going top lane, which is really nice. Unfortunately, we didn't have a dark seal here, but that's all right. It's okay. We we get a lot of golds, and we're just gonna back. No reason to overstay our welcome. Head back mid. We're match and farm. We're we're gonna do a little bit of damage to the mid wave, right? One Q is, should be all enough to full clear the wave, and dragons happening so. Ranger does a zoning ult, meaning people can't walk up in up, up two forwards so that like he doesn't just jump on them. Everyone backs. Uh, for whatever reason, I don't know. This this Riven. I mean, I, I understand that uh, Garen is a rough matchup for Riven, but like, good lord, Th this man just didn't didn't want to match him at all. He's up 40 CS, like, oh, good. Ugh, ugh. No fun, no fun. Bunch of pings, bunch of pings. We're walking over. This is like a really not a great fight because it's all of them and Riven's already dead. But I run through, right? Flip the Kaisa. I know she's dead to poison. Circle around. Right. Uh, I wish Blitzcrank was a bit more aggressive here and like walked forward, but I think he was lagging still, so 
unfortunate. Here I just full full send it. And Boat's Crank is still over there, which kinda sucks. And then he walks in like really, really late. And dies. And then Ash kinda melee ranges and dies. And then Rengar picks up a kill and then Technically, it was an ace. Okay, technically, it was an ace, but we also got aced. So, I don't know. What what, a, what an absolute mess of a of a team fight. Basically, ended up with nothing happening. Uh, we we did get enough gold to get our proto belt though. So we're gonna go top. We know Riven's mid, so she's covering the wave. We're going to go top. We're just gonna shove it in. Get get a little bit of gold, right? Clear, clear, clear. Pick up the next wave, do a little damage to the tower or something. Right, Olaf's here. I kind of don't want to deal with him. Probably just leave. Right. Let's kind of get a nice hook mid into an ash arrow. No, no ash arrow required. Let's kind of get a nice hook off, and then gets Victor. Now let's head back mid. Running directly into the Zolaf, he's gonna immediately ult. Alright. Alright, Olaf fail flashes. I don't know what the deal is with that. For whatever reason, Garen doesn't just like all in here. But uh, I understand that Olaf doesn't have flash or something. So I just went for him instead. Yoink. And this, at this point, I should not have invested so hard. Uh, this was a complete, like, an incorrect, mis like, incorrect decision here because I was hoping my Ignite would come up so I could flash Ignite the, the Garen for the kill. But Garen didn't walk all the way up, unfortunately. So, I kind of, it was just like, it was just in a bad position. Yeah, here we go with the... The greed, the greed happens once again. I, I am definitely not a perfect player, right? I greed a lot too, but like, after that kill, they should just like walk through turret, right? Because they know Garen's around. Maybe just walk through turret around the other side. I don't know. Maybe maybe, maybe that seems too dangerous or something. But if it's just a little Olaf, I think they can handle it. Yeah, here, Blitzcrank gets booped over by uh, Alistar. I don't know what's going on here. Here I am, running around, wasting time, igniting the victor. Everyone's in the pit. He's Anya's. Screw it. I could have put my W a bit further up and maybe possibly escaped, but I misplayed that. <laughs> this Riven was something else, man. Absolutely something else. Head back mid. I know some people are just going to try to force a fight. It's better to like play around our bot lane than our top lane. And Rengar just kind of does what he wants. So Very, very like beautiful pull coming in, right? Hit that Zhonya's. Right? Kaisa doesn't do burst. She gets melted slowly. Right? Here's a Garen. I do a really not great flip here. Yikes. Uh, I don't know why he has that. I guess he's going GA. I don't know. A little strange. Not only like use Zanyas if your if your team's around or if it's like stop like burst or something, but <laughs> I don't know. And here is a very interesting TP. I don't know what this is. I I, I really don't. I don't know what Victor was thinking. You like TP to the, the tower? Like just right there. I don't know. It was so weird. 
It was so odd to me that like someone would do such a thing. But yeah, right now our score is 8-5-12, doing pretty good, all right, our Rengar kind of getting caught sometimes, it's whatever, but we're doing a lot of damage, I don't know if I can check damage, is there a way to check damage? Probably not. Run towards the Kai'Sa, get a really weird looking flip. We're just gonna flip for damage on the Olaf. Alright. And then, uh, for a reason, Riven's bot doesn't want to clear Garen's wave, so. There's that. But Cranky is, uh, right now getting caught by the Alistar and Garen. He went for the kill, and then Rengar goes in, and then they both die. I don't know what that's about. Rengar flamed, called an FF vote, uh, and then. We moved on. <laughs> like, Blitzkrieg shouldn't have been there, but... Ambitious play. Sometimes you're rewarded, sometimes you aren't. He's in a team fight at Dragon. He's gonna run at people, right? Oh, there's Kai'Sa. What's Kai'Sa gonna do? She's gonna dash across the... You know? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, we're we're we got a demonic now. Demonic is really, really nice to have. I don't I don't know. It, it's really like underwhelming at points. But like Having the bonus, like, magic resist and armor and stuff is actually, like, really, really nice to have. But yeah, this, there's no point in, like, contesting this for this dragon. There's two of them. I'm gonna get kited and silenced and whatever. So I just leave. Team fight starts. Running into all of them. Tap Zanias. Keep running, keep running, keep running. Triple kill. We get we get four of them. Garen wasn't here. Uh I At this point I would just leave, right? Because like Garen's gonna start regenning. Like he's regenning now. You don't win that, right? I don't know. Like, why is she still here? It's like wasting time. Like, you, you just... For, for what reason? Well, now it's better because she's there's Baron, but like, kind of like, huh? This is so awkward. What what is this? It's, it's just AFK. Like, uh, huh? I don't know, anyway. Wow, amazing. <laughs> this were, this were even called a surrender vote after that happened. I don't know. She didn't call for help. She didn't type anything, right, during the entire time. But after, after she died, she's like, why didn't anyone help? Like, hello? Just, but you don't... Dying for a tier one tower is like you never die for tower. Like it's never worth it. Unless it's the last bit of gold for every single team, like like item on your team or something. I don't know. It doesn't seem worth like ever. But yeah, back to uh, sin shenanigans. We get to run around. 
Okay, that's that's the main thing. We just run around. Rengar gets picked off. We're walking around, making sure to auto. Right, we do. We are running conquer. Right. Walk, walk, walk. I flip a minion, unfortunately, but I can just run down this Kaisa with no no problem. Hit that Zanya. Keep going. Hoping for a ground, I, I was thinking he was going to be a lot faster, but he just sort of died. Hey, quadra kill. This game's only like two thirds done. This is not an end. Even though we're up, uh, what is that? 8,000, 6,000 gold? Up 6,000 gold. All right, here we're starting a dragon. Proto belt, flip the victor, just run people down. Don't get too crazy. Goodbye, Kaisa. I walk in thinking that Garen doesn't have ult, <laughs> and then Garen does have ult, and then I die. I'm like, oh, well, my bad, I guess. Yeah, and then this this I don't know. She's so useless. What a useless champion. But yeah, uh, hey, just just watch this. I I don't want to say anything. Just watch this. What is this? What is this ribbon? <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> what? He's like, huh? Hello? I don't understand. Yeah, um, they get engaged on and just, just kind of get blown away. I don't know. Not a bad, bad thing to do. I'm grouping up against a uh, Alistar, clumping, clumping. Yeah, what do I do? What do I do here? Huh? I'm just standing mid. I know we can't contest the Baron, so I might as well just clear mid. Make it so that they can't push with Baron. Right? Because most of the time you need minions, unless you can just run people down. Oh no, I'm getting ignited and stuff, and then I walk away. I built Rylai's here, but I actually swap it off for Abyssal Mask later, uh, which did a lot of damage. I was not expecting Abyssal to do so much, but yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, Rylai's not amazing here, not because like the slow isn't useful, is that we need people to die. <laughs> the main thing is we need people to die. So Abyssal would help secure uh, people, at least, you know, everyone else other than Olaf, right? It would help secure kills if I were to flip someone or ground someone. I don't know if that, is that, is that an immobilize? I don't know. I have no idea. I'm pretty sure it is. Cause like you can't do anything, right? There's so many pings. And here we're just doing damage to the waves so they can't push up too hard. All right. Not much I can do here because they're just shoving. Uh, Big Thor makes a decision. Press the Zhonyas. Run out. Run back in. Run out. And we're good. Okay, that was a team fight. We flipped Kaisa. We flipped Victor. Victor lives for some time. Victor lives, but we do get Kai'Sa. This Kai'Sa was really bad. I don't know what's wrong with them. I don't know why you would ever go Collector into like three Bruisers. Four? Eh, tank. Like, what? what is the point of Collector if like the lethality is like negated by like a single armor item? I don't know. Anyways, Collector... 
I think it's better if you went the this one. What is this called? Lord Dominix. It'd be so much better, right? Because like everyone's building HP. Everyone has HP. So like it'd be it would work a lot better, right? With like armor pen and like I don't know. I'm not an ADC player. ADCs, please let me know if uh if if I'm missing something. Like why why is this collector here? Hmm? Uh, I just want to know if, if there's ADC's player watching this and they, they, they want to enlighten me on why anyone would go collector against this team. Thanks. <laughs> just, just straight up, just thanks. Yeah. Alright. Yep. We're 19621. This is like actually a crazy game. I don't, I don't know. I'm not like pogging out. Okay, I'm not going to pog out because it's weird. You know, animated. Oh my god, oh my god. Look at this play and then, you know, whatever. No, I don't. Don't care. No, it's not that I don't care. It's that, um. It, it's weird. It's weird to, uh, like go over the top like that. It's a little strange. Yeah, I keep going because I was like, hmm. Mm. Mm. Keep scrolling with his victor. He procs phase rush. Unfortunate. Get the Zonis before I get stunned. We at least kill him, right? And then we clutch it. We get an ace. Very nice. Garen can kill me, but he used his ult earlier. Now we get a dragon. Nice juicy dragon. And now we have the Abyssal. We got... This is our build now. Protobelt. We got a Demonic. We got an Abyssal Mask. We got Zhonya's. Morello. Alright, Morello for the healing and the healing and the... Sometimes healing. Alright. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. What, what, is, what is there to say? Why am I building Morella while well, they're healing? Why am I building Protobilt? So I can engage. Why did I build Demonic? So I can get like tankier but still do damage because like three of them have a lot of HP. Right? Makes sense to me. It also gives resist, which is also really, really nice. Um, what else? Why did you build Abyssal? Magic resist plus the the damage amp is very nice, All right? All right, here we go. The main thing is to keep Ash safe. It doesn't matter what we do, but as long as Ash is alive, she can just be a turret, and you'll see that here. She's literally a turret. And she gets a penta. I zoned four people. We'll go back. Right. I zoned four people. Shoot. Is it twice? Alright. Watching myself. Running around. Right. Four people are sitting right here. I Zanias, they all clump on me. Right? I die. Thing is, they blow so much on me that they also just can't deal with this ash for some reason. And she gets a penta. To uh, essentially end the game. Mm, just speed this up. Alright. Here's a, here's a weird fight. I don't know why Garen like hard engaged like that. But we get to just kind of run them down. For free, you know? Three of them just die for no reason. Get me out. Get me out of this game. End the game. <laughs> yeah, uh, main thing. Check in, check in the graph. We did 71,000 damage as Singed. We did the most damage in the game. Very nice, very cool, okay? 
CC score 55 not too bad right but that was a really really fun game uh, again I'm going to uh, say to subscribe that that'd be much appreciated thank you very much if you don't subscribe that's all right with me but it's free and it supports me and uh, I can do giveaways and stuff at 1,000 subs which is very nice okay so sub if you enjoy the content or if you want giveaways or both or if you enjoy watching my videos which is also really really cool thank you but yeah thank you for watching uh, this is this will just be uploaded on Saturday or something. I don't know. Sorry for the lack of videos I'm just kind of like I'm kind of just chilling You know, I'm just chilling the the new project skins are nice I don't know if I actually want to play with any of them though like Mordecai is kind of crazy I was in a pants art dragons uh, Mordecai project Mordecai video where he played jungle mord I was the Heimerdinger. I've been playing a little bit of Heimerdinger. It's pretty fun. Did get nerfed. His W got nerfed for like by 20 damage for some reason. I don't know why. Really weird. But yeah, thank you for watching again. Much love. Peace out. I'll see y'all next time.